Cincinnati's iconic Frisch's Big Boy restaurants are disappearing this week and many more closures could be on the way. The investment company that owns the property says Big Boy owes big money for rent and has not served it up by the deadline. Instead of Big Boy's tartar sauce and pies, these days the Frisch's menu is filled with financial squabbles and a side of court filings. At least two Frisch's restaurants in Greater Cincinnati, one in Middletown and one in Lebanon, closed their doors this week. The company that owns Frisch's properties has filed eviction cases for more than 20 other locations, including this one on State Route 28 in Loveland. According to a lawsuit filed earlier this month in Claremont County, the investment company alleges lease payments have not been made on time. The attorney for Frisch's, though, accusing the plaintiff of impractical evictions resulting in needless legal fees and abrupt job losses, among other things. The restaurants want more time, saying all of this could be avoided through an agreed-upon schedule of quick closures. By the way, the first Frisch's opened in downtown Cincinnati 77 years ago. At one point, the company had more than 200 restaurants, and now there are about three dozen here in the area.